Welcome back, Earthlings. Welcome to a brand new stream. Today, we are going to be wearing our lovely Baldur's mask while playing horror games. This should be lovely. This should be a total last. Vision is going to be slightly limited. But I'll try and manage everything the best that I can. Not only is the line of sight very limited on this, but everything has a green tint to it. Yes, we want a new game. We wouldn't be doing much of anything if we'd stayed an old game now, would we? This is going to be very interesting. Hello? Excuse me. Your pizza's here! Being used to the controls is going to be a bit of a hassle, but yeah, let's. Let's change the controls, because down should not be up, and up should not be down. <laughs> so we... Game settings? Hello?
So we're just going to tuck this in here. Let's see if this made a difference. We'd kind of tossed everything around because we were trying to figure out something. And wearing this thing definitely makes the voice echo just a tiny little bit. Hello? Your pizza's here! Let's see how this goes. So, that is just as bad, because okay, so left goes right and right again. This is so confusing. Why do they have to make this so difficult? Let's try this and see how that goes. Let's see what happens. Hello? Your pizza's here! Pizza! <gasps> I'm gonna store clothes about it soon. The control setting for this is so wonky. It's so ridiculous. And no, I don't mean funny. It's like, holy crap, how am I supposed to figure out how to use this control setup? Let's try going back to the main menu one more time. I think if we unselect either of the things that are there, we might be able to get a bit of a better understanding of what's going on. Let's 
see if that makes a difference. Will this make a difference? Um... <laughs> okay then. Alright, so... Yes, this makes a huge difference. This makes a huge, huge difference. Okay. Uh -huh. Hello? I'm looking for someone to take your pizza. Pizza? Someone ordered pizza. Someone... Hello? We also need to try and find the flashlight before... Any... the downsides to this thing is if there's a dark screen area the light goes out the friggin So I got the flashlight. Yay! This is good. This is very, very good. Now that we have the flashlight, we can actually see what we're doing. For the most part. It's going to be very difficult and very limited on... The space that we can see. Hello. Just in there. Right, so we don't have to... <laughs> yeah, like that's not creepy at all. That's not creepy in the light little bit at all. Hello? Creepy clown just sitting in the corner. I don't know your name, but hi. Okay, what do we got here? Let's play at midnight. Alright, so what time is it now? Oh, <laughs> that is just my question. It is midnight. So if we go kind of like this, then 
will be able to see things a little bit. Because as long as we have a little bit of like a light source going on, like hitting here, in some way we are in business. Alright? So hopefully people can hear me. Don't look at her. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, okay. I don't trust you. I don't trust little dolls. Look at this, sh look at the sheer shock on her face. Like, how did you catch me? How did you catch me? My hand was not in the cookie jar, I swear. Okay, you're gone. Hello? Light. Light on? I hope the light is on. Okay, so we're not gonna deal with that. Alright, so... What do we got here? Hello? They locked me up down there. <laughs> um, okay. I don't know why you're just in that position, but okay. I see the clown is no longer over in the corner. <laughs> I see you just standing in there. Oh, oh, just sitting there. Okay, bye then. Late. Hello. What? What do you say? Um. Hello. Hello. Right. Right. So right on. gone really, really dark all of a sudden. Okay. Ah. So go this way. And she turned us around. Aha. Are you do are you gonna be okay? You gonna be all right? Hello. I see you. The intense game of staring begins. Okay, go away. I need to figure out. 
um, hello. Okay, so we got her relatively under control. Hello. Hello. So let's, op let's open this door. Turn the light on. Alright, so we made it to 1, 1 a.m. 1 a.m. Lovely. So I believe this is when more weird stuff starts going on. Right. Hello. <laughs> yeah, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting him move you know, we're just gay continue this is going to be unique and different I can say this, it's definitely a huge challenge trying to do this. And the line of sight is very, very limited. Everything has a very green color to it. We're restarting at We're restarting the restart because we got ourselves killed. Really badly. But how is everyone doing? What is everyone up to? What are your plans for this weekend? Does anyone have any plans for this weekend that they're looking forward to or anything that they're excited about. So she was behind me. How the shit does that work? Like she was, she literally teleported through the frickin' wall. And this is some weird shit that they have in this place. Like the fuck. <laughs> Okay, don't move. Anything? 
thing to interact with. Nope, can't even read that. better this time. What's everyone up to? Freaky doll. I don't trust you. I don't trust you. I don't trust you. Hello? <laughs> um, okay, creepy clown dude. <laughs> I don't know who you are. I don't know what your name is. But you some... You sure are a very, very freaky person. we turned around when we did otherwise we would have been dead deader than dead I think they want to kill me. Um, don't know what those symbols mean, but okay. Right. <laughs> uh, okay. Just teleporter. Just teleporting in wherever he decides he wants to be. Was she? Where the fuck was she? The shit. Doop. 
So let's try again. Let's try and see what we can do. to kill anyone. Door. Light switch. Light switch. Everything looks a lot darker with this thing on. Just saying. You do not understand how difficult it is just to see anything so you want to see another really <laughs> okay we can so that you right. <laughs> we'll show you another <laughs> Yeah, that just happened. That just happened. There we go. Just had to see what was going on for a sec, but... Alright, we are back in this. Discorded cab blown up for a second there, so I was just seeing what was going on. <laughs> So with him we don't move. We just stay still. Right, now that he's gone, we're able to move around again. Right, so she's just gonna stay there. As long as we're looking at her, she does not move. She will not move as long as we're looking at her. She'll just stay right there. Hot light. 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 <laughs> He'd see us if we went in the other room. How did how would he even see us if we were in the other room? How? How the fuck would he see us? How the shit does this ass work? Well, it's alright, we'll get to the bottom of figuring things out one way or another. And, all, and we thought all we were gonna do is deliver a pizza. Shit. 
flashlight fingers. Yes, couch. Uh, I don't know if this is supposed to be like a couch or a chair or something. Donuts. They look like giant donuts. Hello. Do you want my autograph or something? Would you like a slice of pizza? No? Okay. Don't stay still. Okay. So stay as <laughs> stiff as a board. <laughs> you ain't getting me, clown boy. You ain't getting me. I had some friends in the basement. Okay. Me, Chester, Kiki, Mr. Tatters, Mr. Teeters. Friends. Okay. Those are some unusual friends you got there, but all right. Friends don't let friends kill friends. It don't work that way. It does not work out well. Hopefully people can actually hear what I'm trying to say. And this isn't just like blank anything. Creepy gothic doll, just out of nowhere, just right there. Creepy gothic doll up my ass. <laughs> the fuck? The fuck? I didn't even know you had spawned a third time in a fucking row. First she was in front of us, then she was behind us, then she was next to us. Where the f- You never know when the fuck she's gonna fucking pop off. She could be anywhere. She's like a fucking supernatural fucking Houdini. 
I tilt my head sideways like this. Everything burns up a lot for some reason. So if we go like if we kind of go like this, we can actually see things a bit better. I don't know why we have to tilt our head like this to be able to see things a bit better with this on, but I don't make the design of these things. It just kind of does it on its own. This way. Open. Hello. Is there anything out here to like look at or do anything? Hello. Excuse the piss out of you. Where the hell did you come from? I had the flashlight on. I was looking in front of me. And the fuck out of this. <sighs> Don't know what the shit's going on. Creepy version of the Brady Bunch or something? Who's who's that smoky creature thing? Is that one of your buddies too? Hello? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm Don't move till he disappears. <sighs> You're gone, so... Light, light. Alright, there we go. Lights on, we've read that. This tells you how to use a... Tells you what button to use to use a light switch. We don't need that. 
is where we know how to use the light switch. Right, so the clock doesn't change anything until the next hour rolls around. <laughs> So don't move. <laughs> I didn't realize how freaking close she was. I thought we still had a decent amount of space because it didn't seem like she was behind us. But we turned sideways and freaking bam! Why are you freaking there? says I should start recording the log to help with my depression. <laughs> yes, no, it's all about Emily. I can't tell him anything about that. But I'll record myself anyway. Maybe it'll help. Hmm. Well, that probably won't help with anything. If anything, it's just you masking up what you did to your daughter. Which is fucked up, by the way. You shouldn't be locking your child up in the basement. For any shit. Hello. Any... I take, I take care of my friends. I make them pretty. Don't turn around. <laughs> Okay, I, uh, okay, creepy clown. Peekaboo, I see you. <laughs> hey. Uh, no. No. Just no. <laughs> okay then. The creepy clown is just freaking following us around. Light <laughs> switch. Light switch. We got a working light. Hello? Hello? I already read that, so don't need to read it again. Hello? And? Can we literally not pick those up? Okay, that was an interesting little layer glitch. Okay, where? Oh shit! Almost literally walked right into that. That was some fucking fucked up shit.
We're still trying to figure out how to get the sound alerts to like pop up on stream, but <laughs> so we have a lot of stuff that's a work in progress. <sighs> Creepy gothic doll. Where are you? What the fuck? Where the fuck was she? Where the fuck was the creepy doll? This is definitely one a hell of a freaking challenge. A hell of a challenge. But let's see where things go and how things work. So I stay over here, away from creepy clown doll, and gothic doll. Don't know why I'm calling her a clown, but alrighty then. Just gotta keep every light on in the house. I hope you don't mind me ringing up your electric bill. Cool? Cool. Sounds good to me. Light switch. <laughs> Alright, so don't move. Don't move. Stay still. <laughs> You literally came through the wall. You came... She literally came right through the freaking wall. Holy shit. What the... The fuck? Like, she literally came through the wall. Right, there's only one of you, so how the hell did you disappear and reappear so freaking fast? The shit. Alright. Right, so she's gone. <laughs> um. Alright. No moving. <laughs> Being a statue. Alright. Now that his ass has gone away, we can look around here. The long, ominous, dark hallway. Light. Um. How about I just go this way? Yeah, you can just stay right over there and play all the peekaboo you want. Just play all the peekaboo you want from over there. Leave me alone. Don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. All right, thank you. I'm 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 just gonna go this way. I don't want to die. 
I just want to deliver it. I just want <laughs> to deliver it. pizza. <laughs> I didn't know I was going to be playing <laughs> this little game that we got. Alright, so she's just standing up there. Are you having fun? Uh -huh. Looking good, lol. Uh, thank you, Goonie. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you're having a great day. How are you doing? I hope you can hear me well. I hope your Friday is going good. What are you up to this weekend? I know I look like a freaking legend with this on, don't I? <laughs> Alright, so we can't move with him. With the clown there. This is definitely one hell of an interesting game. Doing good, thanks, and you just having dinner. I'm doing pretty good. Just kind of trying to adjust myself to be able to see with this on because depending on the lighting, everything like goes black a little bit, but when everything's lit up, it ha everything has like this green look to it. It's definitely interesting. <laughs> the fucking doll moved. Oh yeah, there are quite a few moving dolls. <laughs> oh boy. He was just about to turn around too. There's like... Three, four dolls, like three or four dolls. Because there's, there's the one doll that Emily calls Chester. And then there's <laughs> Mr. Teeters, who I think is the clown. And then there's the other one. The other doll that she has that I completely forget the name of. Lurking for a bit may lovely BRB. No worries, Goonie. Thank you for the lurk. Much appreciated. Speaking of Chester, he just fucking showed up. Holy fuck. <laughs> I hope you have a great dinner, Goonie. What are you having today, if you don't mind me asking? I hope you're having something delicious. You are always a legend. I love you. Much appreciate. Light switch. Fuck you, fucking Slappy. He looks like fucking Slappy from freaking Goosebumps. Doesn't he look like freaking Slappy from Goosebumps? Is it just me who thinks that? Let me know down in the comments if you think that looks like Slappy from freaking Goosebumps. Or another horror movie or... TV show or something. If he looks like a creepy doll from a different horror movie or TV show or something, let me know down in the comments what you think he looks like, because to me, he looks like friggin' Slappy from Goosebumps. <laughs> Alright, so we're starting off with not moving. Hmm. 
it's even worse when you have friggin' him and friggin' Chester showing up at the same time. Oh boy. Friggin' shit. Thankfully, Chester only just chases you out of a room. But that's about it. <laughs> oh, uh, hello, Mr. Taters. Hmm. Right, so we already read that comment. So we don't need to worry about that. Right. Night switch on. <laughs> right, so don't move muscle. Stay completely still. <sighs> Tilt my head sideways so we can actually see what the fuck we're doing. Ever since we moved in, Emily started acting different. She really liked her old house, so move. I guess it really stressed her out. I don't know. Ever since we moved in, Emily started acting different. She really liked her old house, but we had to move. I guess it really stressed her out. I don't know. Uh, so we didn't really miss anything from running out of the room. I thought we had accidentally... Okay. So we're not moving a single muscle. Not moving anything at all. What? I... Oh, so... <laughs> yeah, there was no way we were making it out of that room. Yeah, fucking murder me and then have the TV come on saying a couple was found lifeless. Yeah, that's because these fucking dolls murdered them. Freaking Emily and her friends murdered her parents. That is what happened. Emily is a little psycho, killing her family and blaming it on the old dogs. Who she probably brought back to life with the spirits of her victims. Is Emily a necromancer? Is that why all games need to be played at midnight? Uh, screw you, freaking <laughs> slappy bullshit. Just gonna let him disappear. Right, so... It's been over a month now. I just want to play. On the bizarre death of a local couple. The couple was found lifeless in their living room as neighbors were driving Where by. Where is she? Wide open and the could be easy yeah, she, she just wants to play hide and seek with her little freaking creepy doll friends. Neither body had any injuries and the cause of death could not be determined by the coroner. It seemed as though the residents were preparing to move. The police have yet to find any leads. The house has been boarded up. The investigation continues. As you hear that creaky, <laughs> freaking <laughs> screechy <laughs> sound. <laughs> right, so you're out of the way. So now we can. We can make our way this way. <laughs> um, hello? <laughs> So at least we can see a bit again. Right, so let's... Uh, oh. Don't run from Chester. Um, yeah, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna run away from his ass. 
We were in the game being chased by the fucking police. Fucking FBI. Yeah, we can't exactly go down there just yet. Okay, that's locked. That's the flashlight. <laughs> Alright, so we don't move when he's around. Just gotta stand still. Don't move the muscle. Alright, so we've come. Wait, do we just have to. I was gonna say, do we just have to deal with each one a certain amount of times before the next <laughs> stage? <laughs> I don't move. It's a nightmare when you have freaking Chester and Mr. Taters in the same room. Uh, okay, so the light on this thing just kind of like faded out. So I thought everything went like completely dark for a second. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're just gonna go in here for a moment. Get a slappy. Alright. All right. We gotta move to the next hour soon. We should be working on 3 a.m. very shortly, I believe. I'd like to say we should be working on 3 a.m. Hello, light switch. Excuse me. <laughs> yeah, screw you, Slappy. <laughs> Most creepiest freaking doll ever. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> Screw you, Slappy. I know, I know um, Emily calls you Chester, but I'm gonna call you Slappy. You look like a freaking Slappy doll to me. I don't know why, do, why we don't have the option to just freaking football kick you over a freaking fence. <laughs> Yeah, just go away there, little creepy clown. Yeah. I don't know why I keep leaning my head forward when... Alright, so we made it to 3 a.m. Isn't this fun? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that depends on what your psychotic definition of fun consists of. This is fucking psychotic. This is fucking crazy. Hey, that's a speaker. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Are you having fun down there? Are you having fun being down in the hole? <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so apparently we're not supposed to see her yet. Apparently we're not to, we're not allowed to see her just yet. This is definitely one hell of a crazy game. Friggin' Discord and notifications like blowing up lately. make an entrance into the basement. But this should definitely be very interesting. <laughs> yeah, don't know why the fuck I keep leaning forward. Like, the only thing I'm doing is freaking headbutting my microphone. Like, the, the camera <laughs> wants to hear me. That didn't quite work out the way I'd hoped it would. I was hoping to kind of go flick on the light switch and be okay. But no, it didn't quite work out the way I'd hoped it would. Everything's green. Every single thing is green. <laughs> ah, there you are, Miss Creepy Doll. Hello? <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> the fuck? The fuck? The fuck? The fuck? The Hello? 
Say this wearing this, wearing this, and then taking it off to grab a drink or something. Just holy fuck. Here, I'll show you guys what it looks like from my perspective when wearing. is very freaking it's very difficult to see We go like this, it's very difficult to kind of see anything. how difficult that shit is. Which, let me tell you, is not no easy feat. So if you think that it's a walk in the park to wear this while streaming, then you are freaking crazy. Because this is not an easy thing to wear while streaming. It definitely makes it a lot more interesting on stream wearing this. Because it brings a whole new challenge to everything. As far as like seeing everything, moving around, interacting with the environment, which is very tricky because when this dims down a bit, it makes it very difficult. see if it lets you see what it looks like through my perspective of things. I want you to be able to actually 
people want to go like it just showing this thing. I need to take it more this way. So yeah, anyone who thinks that this is, if anyone thinks this is easy, you are sadly mistaken, my dude, my dude, because this is not no easy feat, it's not an easy thing to do at all. So we gotta get work on starting this next little bit here. Tilting our head a little bit just to if we can get things working up in here. <laughs> Hello? This angle then. <laughs> well, hello. Creepy <laughs> dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna stop using the flashlight. We're always gonna kind of have it going on. <laughs> oh, that was close. That was really, really close. Thank goodness Chester <laughs> only chases us from one room to another and doesn't cross the threshold. <laughs> right. 
it's just going to be a matter of trying to figure out patterns and figuring out how to keep the upper hand on things. Alright, so we're going to turn that on. Isn't this fun? Yeah, getting chased by killer dolls. Who who doesn't have a blast with that? <laughs> not moving. <sighs> not moving. Right, no, <laughs> For some reason that late switch wasn't going nowhere. <laughs> so he can disappear. What? The shit. The shit. I'm fucking sorry. I'm fucking sorry, but what the fuck? Like you randomly have like hair on your nose or something, even though there's nothing there. <laughs> Fuck you, Slappy. You can go suck some balls for all I care. <laughs> yeah, Mrs. Peekaboo. This is fucking peekaboo. That's all you fucking do is just freaking sit there covering your face like you can't see me. You can't see me. Like fuck you, you fuck you, I can't see you. I can see you just fine. The uh, The fuck The fuck out of you? One of the downsides to wearing this thing is you can hear me, you can hear my heavy breathing just Probably sounds like something out of a fucking horror movie Creeper. Oh look, she wants to give me a hug. Um, I ain't taking my eyes off you, but I'm giving you a hug. 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 Hey. It's 
Um, okay. Thankfully, he doesn't cross this threshold. Normally. There's been a few times he's literally chased from one room <laughs> to... <laughs> I'm gonna stand still. <laughs> yeah, screw you, Slappy. This is fun. If you fucking say so. You little freaking psycho. <laughs> oh, look, more hugs. More hugs. Um, hello. Uh, there we go. More hugs. More hugs. Okay, goodbye. Right, no, no, no. Um, okay. So are you opening or are you closing? I was fucking looking at her. I was fucking looking right at her. The fuck? What do we gotta do? We gotta do ten of this fucking shit now. Try and get some freaking shit. Hello, housekeeping. I fluff pillow. Hello. Speak to me. Fuck. Fuck you. I think we're going to need to just take that off for a bit because it's having a hard time like staying lighted enough for us to see anything because it keeps fading out. But yeah, it definitely adds a lot of challenge to be able to see whatever it is that you're trying to do. And boy, when you take it off, it's like stepping out of the darkness into the light. 
we had to take this off because it was starting to lose the ability to kind of like show things through it. Like it kept going dark like really fast. But yeah, I've been, we've been having a lot of fun using this. I had to take it off because it wasn't lighting things up like we had hoped it would. But we had been using it for a good hour and a half at least yeah, a good hour and a half almost two hours so it was a, so we got a decent amount out of it we were playing some Emily wants to play How is everyone? I hope everyone's having a great weekend. I hope everyone's having a great Friday. What's everyone's plans for the weekend? What are you up to? Anything you're looking forward to? I literally thought he was in the other room a bit back, but apparently not. I know this weekend I'm going to be working on making some improvements to the stream and changing a few things. If you didn't notice, we also have a pet dragon that I've added to stream. <laughs> Damn allergies. Dragon is we can feed a dragon a steak. <laughs> no work on I'm gonna be working on a lot of things this weekend. So, just bear with me. There is a lot of stuff that's a work in progress. <laughs> Excuse me. Mr. Clown Guy is, but... There's friggin' creepy gothic doll person. So we got that. Trying to adjust the camera a little bit. Is <laughs> 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 
For some reason... For some reason it's having issues since... We had kind of adjusted it a little bit to show you how things looked like from my perspective through this. So I had to kind of <laughs> like adjust the camera a little bit to try and make it a little easier. But yeah. At least now it's back to showing my face as I accidentally pull my microphone off the little <laughs> thing that's on. Yeah, fuck you, Slappy. I know your name's Chester, but you look like fucking Slappy to me. Am I the only one who thinks that? Does anyone else say that he looks like friggin' Slappy from Goosebumps? <laughs> Let me know down in the comments what you think that doll looks like to you. I'm really curious to know what other people think that that doll looks like. And if you know of another horror genre that that could show up in as well, let me know. No, oh, for a second there, I thought she was flipping me off. It's like, no. Something completely different. Don't ask me why I thought she was flipping me off. Alright, so she's disappeared, so we don't have to worry about... Right, I'm not even going to bother trying to figure out where he is because apparently he's probably up. he was right there next to us I saw his little fingers okay Go down the ominous. Okay, so don't move. Alright. So turn you on. And Ever since we moved in, Emily started acting different. She really liked her old house, but we had to move. I guess it really stressed her out. I wonder why you had to move. The couple was found lifeless in their living room as neighbors were jogging by. The front door was wide open and the bodies could be easily seen from the street. It seemed as though the residents were preparing to move. The police have yet to find any leads. The house has been boarded up while the investigation continues. <laughs> uh, hi. News, aliens. Uh, Emily. Do you seek in the dark? 
Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> oh, that's definitely one way to wake yourself up really fast. Holy fuck! So now we can go into the ba now we should be able to go into the basement safely. And you see in the dark. Are we like... What? What? Are we supposed to wait for the countdown to start before we go looking for it? Are we waiting for the countdown to end before we can do anything? trying to play in a Those sounds are... They're just normal. They're normal sounds for anyone to be making. <laughs> okay, so you kill me if... I go in the basement, you kill me if the timer runs out. What kind of fucked up rules are these?
So she's not over this way. I seriously doubt she's going to be in the same place twice. She wasn't down, then where was she? This is fucking confusing. I think we need to find her three times. It's just going to be a matter of figuring out where she is. Because she's... She's never in the same place. She was literally right above us one second and poof, she's chasing us. The shit. The shit, Emily. The fuck. gonna pop up this time. So I don't think she's gonna pop up there. Hello? Hello? Closet? Not in, not in the closet. Out, out here. Out here. Nothing. Seriously, nothing. It's not even out here. Yes. 
So I, th I think she's only in areas up here. So hopefully it should make it a little easier for us to find her. But I seriously doubt that it's going to be that easy for us. So it's two times we found her. It's been over a month now, and the police still haven't found any leads on the bizarre death of a local couple. The couple was found lifeless in their living room as neighbors were jogging by. The front door was wide open. So we don't need to. Pay attention to the TV. There you are. So she doesn't seem to be over there. In other news, time travel is fine. This way? Ah, there you are. A whole hour of just friggin' playing peekaboo, hide and seek, trying to figure out where you are. So you're not that way. No, not in here. Not this way. Are you in the kitchen? Ah. <laughs> there you are. So we've managed to find her a, f a decent amount of times. That was kind of weird. So not there. Okay, so we're going back this way. Because we literally never know where she's going to spawn or pop up. Where the fuck is she? Well, that's no fair. That is no fair. No fair. I'm going to add the rest of my can of Pepsi to my coffee.
So we just need to figure out where Emily is. Hello? So, not here. Not in the bathroom, not in there. Not over there. Also doesn't seem to be here. Open. she was fucking hiding because there's no way she was up there because I didn't see her anyway I didn't see her anywhere Doesn't mean she can't be over there. So clearly not in there. Yes, I know. I keep checking the bathroom because you never know if she's gonna pop up in any of the rooms or whatnot. She's just like that. You never know where she's gonna pop up. Or be. literally nowhere upstairs the fuck the fuck is this shit the fuck is this shit
nothing here. No one will help us. No one can help us. This house had a basement in it. We made a place for Emily down there. My husband hid the entrance and no one can ever find it. So they lock their daughter away in the basement. They wonder why her doll friends killed them. That was the first time she was in there. Not there. Not there. Not there. Hello? You're in the kitchen. Nope, she's not gonna be down there. She was back in there. Nothing there. Seriously doubt she's getting even here. There she is. Is there a way she has like a certain pattern that she like kind of sticks to? <laughs> Found you. Not exactly sure how many times we need to find her. We're going to keep checking everywhere for her. No? She's not over here again. What, what about... No. There's no way she's not somewhere. We have literally looked every freaking place. I literally don't know where the hell she was.
Jason. She never spawns anywhere near where we necessarily are. But here's hoping we can find her. Wherever she may be hiding. Literally just checking every place because you never know what is going to happen anywhere at any time. There's always something that could be going on. This way, check out here. Is she, is she in here? <laughs> Where, where else was she gonna fucking me? Fucking looked everywhere. Only found her that one freaking time. Thing in the closet. Welcome everyone. I hope you're having a great Friday and hopefully everyone's having a great start to their weekend. What's everyone's plan for the weekend? Anything you're looking forward to? Anything that has you excited coming up? Doesn't matter what it is, if you have something exciting going on, I'd love to hear what you're up to. I'd love to know what everyone's excited for coming up. Me, I'm excited to work on improving the stream a little bit and adding new things. I know right now some of the sound alerts and stuff aren't working as well as hoped, but it's a, it's a bit of a work in progress. So just bear with us in the meantime. We're working on things the best we can. Mm. Emily? Emily? 
wall. Huh. One time we search everywhere but the bathroom, she ends up being in the bathroom. Alright. Any other random location that you gotta pop up in next? We just found her in the bathroom. Is there any way you're in here? No. Past Rose. Pestros, hey, how are you? I don't think the sound worked, but hellos. Hellos. Yeah, I'm still trying to work on the sound pieces a little bit. I'm, st I'm still getting used to figuring out how some things work. Yeah, I found you on Facebook. <laughs> yeah, Facebook can be really cool sometimes. You always comment on my posts. No, you're fine. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Yeah, I, I enjoy having a lot of fun just <laughs> having a good laugh here and there. I, I was wearing this on stream for the longest time, but I think it was starting to just have a little bit of issues with the whole light sensitive thing. But yeah, <laughs> with this thing on, everything turns green. It's kind of like using night vision without night vision. <laughs> True, I can see a little bit better now. When you when you when you first have it on, it takes a little bit of time to adjust to having it, and then when you take it off, it's just like, holy shit! Was I just was I like in complete darkness or something? Because when you have that on and then take it off, it's like going from a dark room into a fully lit room, like the snap of your finger, you know how it just kind of blinds you for a little bit and you're just like, okay, I need to adjust my eyes. It was pretty much the same thing with that. And it's always a blast to <laughs> try something new. But yeah, how's your day going? I hope things are going well for you. What are your plans for this weekend? Yeah, we've been having fun with Emily Wants to Play. <laughs> yeah, I love checking out stuff on Facebook and meeting new people. Emily's gonna pop up today, this time. Oh! Emily. 
Emily. Is it just me or does Emily look like a lot dead? Like very dead. Are we playing with a ghost? Are we playing hide and seek with the dead? Did friggin' Mr. Tater and friggin' Chester and whatnot kill you too, Emily? 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 So she's... She's nowhere in this room. How can she literally not be in any of these rooms? If she's not there, she's not in here. It's been over a month now, and the police still haven't found any leads on the bizarre death of the local couple. The couple was found by Okay, well, apparently she's gonna find. Alright. Alright, Emily. She just freaking spawns right in front of us. Like, how dare you not find me? This, this is like a freaking broke version of hide and seek. If you don't find me, I'm gonna find you and kill you. Well, okay then. Thank you for scaring me to death. Also, I don't know if people noticed, but we've added a dragon pet to the stream notifications. It shows we have a thing that shows latest follows and our little dragon companion should keyword should be working properly if you wanted to try feeding it and seeing if it responds to you this weekend I plan on working on editing a lot of things and Trying to get the stream working more smoothly with a lot more stuff to do. Yeah, right now it's a bit of a work in progress. But I hope everyone's enjoying the stream and having a great time. to thank everyone for stopping by and hanging out for a bit, watching me jump the shit out of myself. <laughs> ah, there's Emily. Yeah, Emily looks really, really dead. She's not in there. Not in there. Not in here. Not even behind the door. And what about out here? Nothing. We're not, we're not seeing her anyway. Okay, that was a 
We have a glitch in the layering system of the game. There's so many places she could technically be. Uh, hello? Hello? Did, did she like completely like disappear? Like completely just poof. fucking rolling back in her head like ah, fucking psycho fucking psycho fucking loony bin fucking cuckoo banana fucking crazy shit It'd be friggin' hilarious if we had ran into a room and she had just been like right there. Hello. Hello. Emily. 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 She's not over this way. Is she in here or in the bathroom? No. So nothing there. Ah, there you are, Emily. So we're able to. We're able to find her a few times. Right, so I think once we finish our game of hide and seek with her, then we should be able to use, we should be able to go into the basement then. every single time but I'm gonna keep searching everywhere to try and find you. be in one of these rooms. I 
I'm gonna try and read that right now. Founder. So I think we just need to keep trying to find her until it's been over a month now, and the police still haven't found any leads. The timer changes from 4 a.m. to 5. There you are. So we have to... I think the whole idea is to try and last till 6 in the morning. But I could be wrong. Uh, we we're we're doing pretty good. We're doing decent. What do we got going on here? No, Emily. Emily, no. Emily, no. No, Emily. No, Emily here. Please change to five. Estelle Rose. Oh. by going over this way. There she is. There you are. I don't think she can... I don't think she's in the basement. He's, that's one place we still can't... Excuse me. So one place we still exactly can't go to. Okay, so now we head that way. Oh, this way. The most deadly game of hide and seek we will ever play. No, no, no. Emily. <clears throat> I swear, she's always gonna pop up in the most random places. Hello? 
police still hadn't found any leads on the bizarre death of a local couple. The couple was found lifeless in their living room as neighbors were jogging by. No way she's in there. What about you? Hello? Emily? Emily? Nothing? Hold on, shit. Beside of extra shit. With Emily, she never shows up in the same place. So we constantly have to like keep searching for her and looking for her. Like, okay, she was in this room. So we have to travel to X amount of rooms to try and find her again. See if she's even in any of these side rooms. We're just gonna make a... So we found her there. So chances are she's gonna pop up somewhere on the other side. Right here. I'm just gonna do a quick check. Make sure she didn't pop up over this way. Now we're gonna go back here. So she's not in this area. She's not there. Oh, there she is. It's going to be a matter of figuring out where her next location is going to be. Ah, there she is. Sometimes when it comes to finding Emily, it can be very easy. It's just like, Go into a room. Oh, she's right over there. Other times you can like go searching for her and literally not find her anywhere. Hello. Is there a way that she might be over this way? No, oh, no. How about out here? Hello. 
Hello. Did she like pull a fucking Houdini and just literally vanish all together? Because I literally am not finding her. I think we have enough time for one more try and then we're going to call it good for today. to zilch. Ah. There you are, Emily. I was starting to wonder if I was going to find you. Yeah. Good thing we checked there. This way. Okay. okay. Is she literally not anywhere? I literally am not seeing her anywhere. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that your whole name. So I apologize if I mispronounced most of that trying to pronounce it. But I hope you're having a great day. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Happy Friday. Oh shit. 
Someone just mentioned me. No. It's all good. We had Dora Strix Dora Strix Vart Vrak Dora Strix Vrak I hope you're having a great day. I'm sorry if I'm butchering your name. I promise I'm trying to pronounce it the best I can. I hope you're having a great Friday. I hope your day's going well. And what are you up to this weekend? I hope things are going good. I hope there's something exciting going on that you're looking forward to. We've been having some fun with Emily wants to play. And like quite literally, you never know where she's going to pop up. And sometimes you can literally search everywhere and still not find her. I swear it's worse than playing hide and seek with a ghost. At least with a ghost, you have somewhat of an idea of how to find them. Just a reflection of the surface. The way that they did so the layering for the game is a bit confusing is some of it's kind of like scattered because if you look at certain areas a certain way you get like that black kind of odd look to things <laughs> I call bullshit on that because she was literally not there a second ago when we were looking over there. Friggin' time runs out. She's just staring at the ceiling. Oh, fuck. You're right there. Let me tackle you. going to be our last round of doing this. I, I hope everyone's been enjoying the stream. I hope everyone is excited for the weekend ahead. I'd love to hear if you guys have anything exciting going on. Any amazing plans that you have that you're looking forward to. over there. Emily. Ah. There you are.
Emily's looking a bit zombified. side of squat for today and I hope everyone enjoyed the stream I hope everyone's had a lot of fun and I'll see everyone again soon It's like a very complicated game of like hide and seek because you have dolls that do different things when you're doing things and right now we're in a one-on-one -on -one game of hide and seek with Emily which is timed if we run out of time when the when the timer counts down then she finds us and kills us and we literally have to just keep circling around the house in the dark trying to find her it is very complicated if you like games that have a lot of jump scares I would highly I would highly recommend checking it out and seeing if you like it. If not, that's fine too. And not everyone is a huge fan of horror games. But it's always cool to find out something new. Uh, 
And in the meantime, Earthlings, stay awesome, and I'll see you again soon.